He's been coaching for more than 20 years, but for Ty Scroggins, the last four at DeSales may have been the most special. Heather Fountaine joins us live now from the high school football field for the report. Heather? Well, Coach Ty Scroggins has spent years turning kids into better football players, some of them even champions. But recently, he's working closely with his own son. Here at DeSales, a father's dream to coach his boy comes true. You got to get this in the end zone. Coaching on high school football fields for over a decade. Yes, take a deep. Ty Scroggins is no stranger to championships. Leading his team to five as head coach at Central High School. The things that we've done at Central, they're continuing to do it. But for the last four years, he's found himself on new turf. Not just as a coach, but a father. It's my dad. Like, even on and off the football field, he'll help me throughout the game. Scroggins' son, Jaden, a senior and starting quarterback for the DeSales Colts. And there's his dad by his side as an offensive coordinator. Being able to see your son just develop as a football player, develop as a young man, grow up from, from that little kid with no hair on his face now, he's got a full beard. It's, it's been a joy for me to watch. Though Scroggins decided to stop coaching Jaden directly. Sometimes I don't know how to take the coaching hat off at the dinner table. The bond they've built is even better with this brotherhood. And be able to, to share the moments that, of success and the moments of failure with him. So, and I think that's been the best thing that I've, I could have ever done. Watching his boy grow from the sidelines instead of the stands, he says he's most proud of the leader he's become. Having a voice of his own and not daddy's voice, not Coach Scroggins' voice. And Jaden working hard, hoping to give his father one more trophy one the entire team is fighting for. Watching him coach and win state championships, I really like to win one with him. And Coach Scroggins has also helped create the Kentucky Minority Coaches Association. Some pretty great things coming from this family. And speaking of great, the weather has truly been wonderful, and I think we have to thank our good luck charm, Alden, for that. Good luck charm. I don't know if anyone.